Okay, so my Z6 has finally arrived. So that means I can do an unboxing first of all. So just before we get started, this video is being recorded by both the Z6 and the Z7. So I have the Z6 right in front of me here, and I then have the Z7 to the left of me over here. So there'll be like a B-roll that's shot up and over of the box. That will be on the Z7. So let's get straight into it. The box on the outside looks very similar to the Z7 box. New black and then yellow design around the bottom. Only difference being it says Z6 on it and has a Z6 over here. Okay, so let's take a look what's inside. First and foremost, we get an XQD card in the box. This is only in certain regions, so please check. Then we have the Z7, Z6 manual. Interestingly, the um, Z7 comes with a manual that just says a Z7 on it, whereas it says the 6 and the 7. Next, we have a leaflet that talks about how to use the FTZ adapter. Interestingly, this is just a body only, it doesn't come with the FTZ adapter, so that's still in there as well. Let's check out the accessories that we get. First of all, the USB to USB-C cable. UK power supply plug. Battery. Camera strap. We then get a tethering connector. So this is if you're tethering out the side of the camera, this actually screws into the camera to keep it in place. Stops you from ripping the cables out. Um, the Z7 also came with one of these and also did the D850 did as well. But it's really nice that it screws into the body, keep it nice and secure. We then have a charging block. So you can pop the battery straight in this block and it will then charge from the wall. Okay, so that's it for accessories. And then we have the Z6 itself. So there we go. Okay. So now that I finally have my Z6 in hand, there's gonna be a range of videos to do with its autofocus. Also low light tests against a D5, D750 to see how this performs at 51,000 ISO. Also comparing it to D500, things like that as well, see which one works better. Also be some autofocus tests, low light autofocus tests as well, versus this, versus the um, Z7, D850, all those different types of things. So if you are interested in Z6 related videos, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel because they will be on the way in the next few weeks. Hope you found this video useful and hopefully you find some of my videos that are gonna be out in the future useful as well. I'd love it if you can subscribe to the channel, give this video a like, and if you have any questions about the Z6 or the Z7 as well, then please do comment below and I can see if I can help you with that. Thank you very much.